P, Q, and R are sharing profits and losses in the ratio of 5 is to 3 is to 2. R retires from the firm and his share is taken by P and R in the ratio of 2 is to 3. I'm sorry, this is not R because R has retired, so this is Q. You are required to calculate the new profit sharing ratio. Again, let's first try to understand what is being said here. So you have three people over here. P, Q and R. They are sharing profits and losses in the ratio of 5 is to 3 is to 2. Right? Or can we say that it is 5 by 10, 10 being the sum of 5 plus 3 plus 2, 3 by 10 and 2 by 10. Right? So they are sharing profits and losses in the ratio of 5 tenth, 3 tenth and 2 tenth. Right? Now R retires from the firm. Okay, this guy, sorry, R is this person. R retires from the firm, okay, and his share is taken by P and Q in the ratio of 2 is to 3. So the share of R, which is 2 by 10, is distributed amongst P and Q in the ratio of 2 is to 3. If the ratio inter say between them is 2 is to 3, can we say that P got 2 fifth, which is 2 plus 3, 5, and Q got 3 fifth of the share of R, right? Or in other words, P, he is originally owning how much? He is originally owning 5 tenth, and Q is owning 3 tenth. How much does he get from R? So P will get two fifth of share of R. How much is R's share? Two by tenth plus, right? And Q will get how much? He will get three fifth of share of R, which is two by ten, right? Let me just draw a small line over here. In other words, this becomes how much? This becomes 4 by 50 and this becomes 6 by 50. Right? So if we see P on a standalone basis, so P will get how much? He originally had 5 by 10 plus he gets 4 by 50 from R. Right? So 50 is the LCM of 10 and 50. 50 divided by 10 gives you 5 times 5 gives you 25 plus 4, 29 by 50. So the new ratio of P or the new share of P is going to be 29 by 50. Let's do this for Q as well. 3 by 10 is what he had originally. 6 by 50 is what he get. LCM. 15, 21 by 50, right? So the new ratio is equal to 29 by 50 is to 21 by 50 or 29 is to 21, right? So how did we find out the new ratio in this case? We knew one partner moved out, okay? So whatever is his share that gets divided between the remaining partners, we know how much is the remaining partner getting? Whatever is the share they are getting in the ratio of 2 is to 3. Or in other words, 2 fifth goes to P, 3 fifth goes to Q. We calculate how much is 2 fifth of his, this share, 3 fifth of this share and add it to the original numbers for P and Q. Once we do that, we get what is their new profit sharing. Okay, when we compare these two, we get the new ratio. Thank you for being with us today, right? Look forward to having you in many more lectures. If you like this video, please hit the like button. You can also join us on Facebook. Okay, it's facebook.com slash myiedubook. 
iedubook.com is the website where you will get all these video lectures class wise level wise subject wise